So this is a little introduction to the Eucentrics workout. So Eucentrics is a program that stretches and strengthens the entire body. So it's going to leave you feeling longer, leaner, more toned, and greater flexibility in your full body and range of motion. So after each workout, you actually, you really feel like you've toned your body, but you feel this real freedom in your joints and a lot of mobility, which is something that you don't usually feel after a body toning workout. So in this little short um, demonstration, if you follow along, you're going to really feel exactly what I'm saying. You're going to feel all those benefits. Normally we do 30 minutes to an hour. That's our normal kind of workout, but this one's going to be a little short one. Okay, we're going to start with a warm-up. We always warm up the joints and the body. So bend the knees, tuck under. One of the positions that we do a lot is tucking under. I'm going to turn to the side so you see it. So that's just tucking the bum under. Not forward, not back, keeping your body straight and tucking under. So when I say tuck under, you just get into that position. So tuck under and lift those arms up, pull up and open back. Reach up and back. Now we're going to go a little faster, just swing the arms up and down to get the blood flowing. Pull them up and down. Now this is loose because we're doing a warm-up here. We just want the blood to get flowing. And up and down. Lift, down, lift, lift, and last time, lift and down. Now pretend to grab a frisbee and throw, throw. So this is just a nice kind of loosening up the body. So you pretend you're throwing a frisbee. Just loose upper back, loose shoulders, loose swing. Swing, 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 and swing. Four more. Two, three, and four. Now take one arm back and around. So this, you're now rotating in your shoulder joint for this part of the warm up. Back and forward. Back, and when you come forward, tuck under. So you'll start feeling a little stretch through your spine and through your back. Round and other side. Take the arm, pull it back. Back. Shoulder forward, rotate. Back and around. Pull back. Shoulder forward. Back. Forward, two more. And good. Okay, so we're going to start with a little stretch. Bend those knees, tuck your bum under, bring your arms back, reach to the back, shoulders forward, reach to the front. So you're pulling those arms apart so you start feeling the shoulder blades opening up. Reach to the front, grab your fingers. Pull forward, bend your knees. Now bend those elbows, lift them up, shoulders forward, tucked under so you're getting a nice little stretch through your spine. Pull the fingers apart so you feel it pulled in the shoulder blades. Push to the front, lift up. Now start pulling up in those abs. So reach, 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 reach. Pull up in those abs. Let go of your arms. Pull one arm up, pull it behind your ear. Now don't drop, don't sink in your lower back. Keep pulling up. And back. Other arm straight up. Reach, reach, reach. Abs tight. This is helping you flatten out those abs. Pull both arms straight up. Abs in. Pull back. Make sure your weight is forward. Flip your palms to the back. Open. Push. Push those shoulders back. Elbows back. Palms back. So you're feeling that nice stretch in here and through your shoulder blades all the way down. Good. You're going to lift one arm up. Bend your knees. Reach. So you want to feel the pull in your side. Keep your abs nice and tight. The whole workout we work on the abs, flattening them. So all of these stretches, when you're stretching, strengthening and flattening your abs together at the same time. So grab, so grab something from the sky like an elastic, pull down. So you're going to crunch the side, crunch. Now tuck under, rotate your shoulder and reach that arm to the front and pull. You're going to start feeling a nice stretch right through here. Now lift it up, try to touch the ceiling. Pull, pull, pull and do it again, pull down down. Now rotate that shoulder, tuck under. So you're not leaning forward or back. You're just tucking under. Bring that arm to the front. Pull. Feel a nice stretch. Bend a little deeper. Lift up. Pull, pull, pull. Abs in. Use your sides. Other side. Lift that arm as high as it'll go. Grab the elastic. Pull down. Crunch the side. Now rotate. Tuck under. Rotate the shoulder. Pull to the front. Pull. So don't go with it. You're pulling that arm across so you feel that stretch. Bend a little deeper, lift up, pull up, up in the abs and again down. Crunch, pull that arm down, tuck under. So we're really working hard here, pushing that arm, pulling it across, trying to touch in front. Reach, 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 which for me is a camera. 
pull and down. Now lift that other arm up. Now we're going to push down to the floor. So bend the knees, tuck under, push to the floor. Now we're going to reach. Little lunge, pull. Abs in, pull. Now sweep the arm down, bend the knees. As you bend the knees, make sure that they're pushing back and the knees are right over the feet. Open up, open your chest, abs in, pull a little further, lift, 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 and over. Change arms, take the bottom arm, lift it up, reach it up, reach, 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 now push down, bend the knees, push. So nice rounded back, you're getting a stretch in the back. Pull that arm straight, so nice straight back, nice stable knee, sweep down, sweep, plie, so bend those knees, push the knees back, open that chest, lift, use your abs and your sides, and over. Gonna do two more. Now you've kind of got the hang of it, pull up, reach, 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 push down. Straighten up that arm, lower the shoulder, straighten up that leg, back, straight also, now down, sweep, round your back, feel a nice stretch through your back, lift, up, pull up, and over, last time, other arm sweeps up, lift it up, push it down, round your back, now straighten it all up, straight back, abs tight, reach, and down, round, open up that chest, lift, 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 good. So those are all exercises that we call our trademark exercises that are really flowing and help to work the waist, the back fat, and all the stretching of your entire torso. Now, now we're going to work the arms. So flex those palms, straighten up the elbows, lift up your shoulders, lower them, lower them again. Really push them down and pull those arms out. Now you should already be feeling a funny feeling under your arms. These are really great weight free arm toning exercises. So abs in, abs tight, ready, pump down, pull. So these are slow. We're not using momentum, but we're using our own strength of our muscles to push down, down, down. We should do eight, but I'm not counting. Pull back, one, pull out and back, two, three. Keep those abs nice and tight. Don't flail around. Keep your shoulders down, uh, seven, and eight. Fingers to the front. Pull out and up eight. One and two. Pull up in those abs. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Now pull back. Reach and two. Slow enough to use the muscles for not momentum. Five, six, seven, Eight, pulling up in the abs. Flex again, pull out, we're gonna do four. One, two, three, four, back four. One, keep that core nice and stable. Four, fingers to the front, up. Two, three, four, back. One, two, three, four. Now bring those arms in, open, out, round. They're just loosening this up now because that's kind of, usually I do that for three or four minutes and that was probably about 45 seconds. So you can imagine how that feels. For three or four minutes, you get a nice arm tone. I'm gonna do just a little bit of plies. Something we do to work this muscle and for the groin. So we nice thinning out this muscle. So this is not a squat. There's no turning in and no bum out. Back straight, Tai Chi ballet style plies. Back straight and down. Push those knees back. You want a nice, stable knee, good position, no torsion on the knee. So it's knee right over the foot. Back, abs in, down. So squeeze your butt and come up three. One, two, squeeze down. When you come down, push those knees back. One, two, three, push back, abs in. One, two, three, shoulders back, down. One, two, three, stay down. We're gonna work your foot while you're here, shoulders up and down, other side. I forgot to mention that this is done without shoes. We work the feet in this workout as well. So we're just changing feet and change and change. Last exercise up here, pull those arms up, pull up in those abs and down. So as you can see, we're working the legs, but at the same time we're working the abs, the arms 
and the waist. Pull, pull. So one arm goes up, the other down. Reach and reach. Now one arm down, bend a little deeper. Pretend you're gonna touch the floor, but make sure your weight is forward. Lift and up, down, lift, down, reach, weight forward, lift, tight abs, down, reach, lift, good. Pull those arms up, abs tight, arms apart. Reach for the front, twist on your spine. So you've got one arm back, one arm in front. These are called windmills. Pull apart, back palm turns up, back palm up and windmills. The arms of windmills move together. So your arms are gonna move together. As the back arm comes up, the front arm goes down. So reach it up. Now pretend you have a weight on the top arm and push down, push. Push, 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 push. Now twist on your spine, pull. These are amazing for posture. Back palm up, reach. Front arm goes down. So you can feel that working in your shoulder blade. This is really working your waist as well and your posture. So we're doing toning, stretching, range of motion. All the things at the same time. Pull up in those abs, shoulders down, back palm up, reach up, pull, 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 pull. And down, twist, last two exercises. Lift that arm up, lunge one direction, reach and pull. Now bring the back arm up, come back to the center, up. And you're gonna lunge the other way, take the top arm and bring it down. Reach a little further. Up, 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 center, down. Reach further. One, two, three, pull, and down, and come back up, arms up, down, release. Okay, so that was just a little introduction to eccentrics. This was our standing portion. We also do floor work to tone the legs, the abs, the butt, and uh, stretch, and also bar work that really gets into um, your quads and your psoas and your hamstrings. So there's a full workout in this. This was just a little sample of our eccentric standing workouts.